Friends, are you available for tonight? I am. Why? We need you for a mission. That's why. Who's going to be there? Me, Zhao, and of course you. However, I don't know who else will be there. Sure. I'll meet you later tonight. Thanks, friends. Oh, also, you need to wear something nice, okay? Um, okay. Tell you when we get there. All right then. Ah, uh, we're here. Absolutely not. What? What's the matter? I'm not going inside that that casino. But you've been to many casinos. So it's the only place I do not want to step into ever again. We're already here, so we aren't turning back. I'm not going back there. End of discussion. Fair warning for the both of you. I met the person who owns this casino and she's... How do they put this? Very interesting. Well, she can't be that bad, right? Right? Oh, masters. Friends, you didn't tell me about a new guest. Come into my office. We must have a chat. Oh, great. So, what are two spies and an agent doing in my casino? Pardon me, but how did you... <laughs> oh, please. It's quite obvious to me when I see one of the LHPD on my territory. Melissa, you don't have to give them a scare for the first impression. Yes, ma'am. I beg to differ. You almost burnt the kitchen in my winery, dropped multiple drinks on the floor, and spit one on the table. Look, even though I may mess up a few times... I can't screw up this time, I'm sure of it! Please don't. These wines are more on the expensive side when it comes to places like these, and the casino owner already told me that if any of these bottles are broken, it's coming out of my pocket. Don't worry, I won't break anything, I promise. Hey, I might even have more customers come to me. Ha! Fine, 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 that's all you two are talking about. Well, you didn't come if you hate wine that much. Madam Callista told me that if I helped, she would return the favor and come to the cat's tail to help teach a few cats not to spit hairballs into other people's drinks. Well, I guess that is a win-win situation. Why are you two here, hmm? To get tired of the small businesses and want to try something big? Well, that's not really the case. One balloon and blank! No! What is a Fatui scum doing here? Sorry to say, but I can't, or even will, tell you. Okay! D Luke, you can go over there and I'll get you that drink. Don't speak to me for at least five minutes. I gave you a warning and didn't believe me. Look, we're here for our mission, so can we please get it over with? Fine, whatever. Wait, neither of you told me what this was all about in the first place. Oh, right. <clears throat> Ningguang told us that there were two Mafia members that were going to be here and we need to, well, watch them and make sure they don't do anything well, stupid. that sounds easy enough. 
So, Mr. Um, Fatui guy, what are you doing here? Trying to give away all your mora? Ha! No! Of course not. I have business here. Ha! Huh. Well, so much for small talk. Do you look, my man, my, uh, bro? What do you want, Gil? Cheapest wine here, so my daughter doesn't look at my bank account. Should have known you would say that. So, please give me your cheapest wine. Oh, come on, a royal flush? You have definitely got to be cheating. Tough luck, sir. You just need to be better at Tavat Showdown. Fine, another round. My poor wine is at stake. All right then, but it's your loss. Well, what do we have here? The General Mondstadt. Huh? Who's asking? Don't you recognize who I am? Hmm, not really. You know, Tartaglia, part of the Mafia? That does not ring a bell. <sighs> The ginger-headed man from Snejnaya. Oh, I know who you are. <laughs> Wait, why are you here? I should be asking you the same question. Why is one of the generals gambling to their heart's content at this very casino? I can't answer that. Besides, my match is starting. Be gone, ginger-headed man. Well, all right then. Hmm, maybe one game wouldn't hurt my bank account. Well, I never thought that two Harbingers would be in the same place. That's interesting, but I think something's off. What? What is it? It's... it's one of the sergeants from Zagonomia Island. Wait, what? Dad? What are you doing here? <laughs> Nothing, ma'am. Wait. You sound just like my daughter. How much did you spend? Just a few, maybe a hundred mora? He spent, let's see, maybe about 30,000 mora. 30,000 mora? I was going to try and stop him, but he insisted. Boss! See, this is why one should be banned. He's already drunk of his mind. And probably wants more wine. Well, if wine was banned, I think we all wouldn't be standing here now, would we? So, we could just sell water for all I care. What Tsunami is trying to say is that you'd be out of business. And that also means you can't take care of your cats either. Well, um... Apologies, Diona. But I don't think wine will go out of business. Well, isn't he supposed to be on the control or something? <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. I give up! Child, what in Tevat are you doing? Nothing! I swear! Are you gambling? No, I am not! Then why did Pantalon text me saying that you lost almost 4,000 more in a span of 20 minutes? Well, you say, see, uh... Just, uh, don't do anything else that can get you broke. Yeah, yeah, I'm distracting the LHPD. It's like we have more company. You know, sis, you could have told me you were part of the photography and intelligence department. Well, I have to photograph for the Steambird, and they told me I could take the day off. So, why not follow you here, my dear brother? I'll let you photograph and maybe, maybe let Charlotte ask questions if you catch one of them. You have a deal, brother, but leave the more private info to me. What are you saying, dear sister? Who's Ganyu? Masters, you're just the kindest person I've met, Ganyu. Maybe you should work for me instead of the LHPD. Oh, um, no thank you. I'm okay with my job, but thank you for the, um, offer. Ma'am, someone would like to meet you. Oh, well, duty calls. I'll see you later, Ganyu, dear. There's another Harbinger, isn't there? There's another Harbinger. So what are we waiting for, exactly? Just wait. I'm sorry, who are you? I'm Faye, Franz's sister. Nice to meet you, too. He you too! So, who wanted to speak to me in my off... is Ah, Madame Callista, nice to meet you. Mama, what is a hope you're doing in my casino? 
Here's a great welcome to my casino. Madame Callista, I'm sure you know why I am here. I'm sorry, but you might have to specify why you're in my casino. <sighs> if you want me to be specific, then fine, I'll be specific. <clears throat> We know you have something we want in this very casino, and that something is the file of marine sewing. I'm sorry, who? Don't act stupid with me. You may fool everyone else, but I'm not that stupid. I have seen many of the LHPD, so I suspect you work with them, no? Clever, but I think you're talking to the wrong person. I don't own any of the files from the LHPD, and I'm not handing over jack shit. Will turn, cause I have to go to the station and ask politely. <laughs> Excuse me? You heard me loud and clear. Don't you dare talk about how my father would act. I'm just saying he would be disappointed. Get the hell out of my office. Now! Not until I get what I asked for. I guess I have to make you leave by force. You know, I think you guys should help her. Or not. Either way, I get something for Charlotte. I'll get the gear. You two have fun. Wow, I did not know being a distraction would be this boring. Here's Dandelion one. Nah, I'm alright. Now he's fighting the casino owner. <laughs> Lucky. Shouldn't you help your colleague? He can live. Never, ever come back to my casino ever again. So, how are you going to explain this to the Soritza that you failed miserably? Shut the hell up. <laughs> Just saying. I'll figure it out! How? Just how did you fail that banditore? He's definitely pissed off the owner of the casino. Child, shut up. Yes, ma'am.